Hi everyone, I'm Lisa Murray, class of 1990. You're watching R360 News. Have a good day. Good morning, Red Hawks Nation, and welcome to your R360 morning announcements. I'm your host, Mrs. Nix. Welcome to Wednesday, April 8th. It is day one on the school calendar. With Easter approaching this weekend, we have a couple of egg crafting ideas coming your way from Isaiah and Kyra Friesen this morning. Let's check them out. Isaiah Friesen here, and I'm going to be showing you how you can decorate eggs with robotics. So this little Lego contraption actually made this, and I'm going to teach you guys how to do it. So all you need is an egg, a Lego EV3 set, and then all you have to do, stick your egg in, close it, take a thin tip sharpie, and let it run. And here you can choose what you want it to do. So I'm going to do this. So I'm going to be showing another way how to decorate eggs. You need rice and a bowl, food coloring, a lid, and a boiled egg. Choose whatever color you want. I'm going to go with blue. One, two, three. Get your egg, put it in, get the lid, and then open it up, and here you have a blue Easter egg. While we're on the topic of eggs, let's turn it over to grade one reporter Avery Selfie who is in the hen house for our next pet profile. And now, another installment of Pet Profile from Red Hawks Nation. Hi, this is Avery, one, two, a. Here are the chickens and geese. The geese are super loud and we're gonna collect eggs today. Hey, I get to share a goose egg. Slowly walking, looking naked, so the chicken sees me. Egg. Look how big it is. <laughs> I got an egg. Finally, I found the egg. And now we can eat it when we get inside and we wash it up. Bye, geese. Bye, cats. Are you enjoying all of this talk about eggs? If you are, you're in luck because we have more egg coverage coming your way on the news tomorrow. But before then, let's turn it over to a high school reporter for our next Rosenor name, school name drop. This is Name Dropping, the game where Red Hawks staff and students try to outdo each other with who has the most remarkable friends and family members. By implying or directly asserting a connection to people of high status, the name dropper hopes to raise his or her own social status to a level closer to that of those whose names he or she has dropped and thus elevate himself or herself above, or into, present company. I need you to act as my bodyguard, like my friend Kevin Costner in that movie where he was a bodyguard. The bodyguard. Hello Red Hawks Nation, this is Emma Pauls on Name Dropping. Hi Red Hawks Nation, I'm Emma's uncle Mike Conkin, I'm the weather specialist for global news on television and on radio. And now, another R360. Joke of the day. What does Lego Elsa say? Okay. Lego, Lego. Is that good? Yes, Emily, that was good. Remember to send in your jokes to Mr. K. Those are your Rose Nerd School announcements for today. 
tune in live at 10 a.m. tomorrow for a special announcement from me, Mrs. Nix, as I officially launch a PE Instagram account. On tomorrow's news, we will also have more fun crafts, a science experiment update, and of course, it's Trivia Thursday. I'm here. I'm, I'm ready. I'm ready. Oh, Miss Friesen, we started the news 10 minutes ago. Last time you were here with a different mask, what happened? This is what I look like now, after two weeks of online learning and answering emails. All right. Well, before we sign off today, remember students, R360 is the news program where you are the reporters. To keep our morning news show running, we need your clips, so make sure to send your videos to Mr. K. That's right, Ms. Nix. We are always looking for more pet videos, science experiments, and activities that you've been doing while learning from home. We would also love to have creative sports reports from around the nation. Which of your hamsters would win in a 100 centimeter dash? Feats of strength, marble races, whatever you can come up with. We want to see entertaining and bizarre characters or personas reporting the news. So send in your clips. And remember, we're always looking for the most impressive name drops and jokes of the day. Have a great day of learning from home, everyone. And remember, wear a mask. Maybe not that one. One. So much better.